Hey guys, this is EJ Holland with the Wolverine.com. And we're back with another Recruit of the Week segment. This week's Recruit of the Week is Brian Robinson on 300 Edge out of Austintown, Ohio, Fitch High School. Robinson was on campus for an unofficial visit over the weekend for Michigan's game against Hawaii. So all eyes were on elite 2024 quarterback Jaden Davis, but Michigan made a huge impression on Robinson. Now, if you are a part of the Wolverine community, you know people have been beating down the door. They want an Ohio kid to commit to Michigan. None this cycle in 2023, but I think Robinson is a prime candidate in 2024 to be a pool out of the state of Ohio. Does not have an offer from Ohio State yet. Obviously, that could change um, you know, the, the forecast of his recruitment. But as things stand right now, I think Michigan has the lead coming out of the visit. Now, I personally have not put in a pick for Michigan just yet. I am still a little weary of uh, of Ohio State coming in and extending an offer and changing the course of the recruitment, especially being, you know, in the Youngstown area. Um, Yeah, it's going to be a little tough, but I do think there's a lot going for Michigan in this recruitment and even if Ohio State offers I still think Michigan can win this recruiting battle I don't want to make it seem like oh, Ohio State's going to offer and now we need to forget about this kid no I think Michigan can win this recruiting battle straight up with the Buckeyes but I think it'll be a lot harder to do so if uh, Michigan's biggest rival gets involved. Uh, with all of this said, Michigan hit a home run this weekend. He was really impressed with the night game atmosphere. Really loved what Michigan did uh, from a defensive standpoint, albeit against a lesser opponent in Hawaii. Just really enjoyed the scheme. The dominance of the defensive line has bonded really well with Mike Elston, Michigan's new defensive line coach, who has been recruiting him hard uh, for a while now and yeah I I just think that the visit went as well as it could have he had a chance to bond with some of the players some of the commits including uh 2024 commit Mason Curtis who recruited him hard he spent some time with uh Jaden Davis as well who's not a Michigan commit but obviously looking like a lean I know they spent some time talking about recruiting as well um other schools involved here Notre Dame Penn State I think are are some of the big ones. He also has some offers from some schools down south like Georgia and Texas A&M. But I do see uh, Robinson staying uh, kind of in in Big Ten country. And so I I do think Penn State is a factor here. He's been to Notre Dame in the past. Uh, But I think Michigan has a lot to offer in terms of off the field. So I think that gives them an edge over Penn State. Robinson, a great kid off the field, high academic kid. And with Notre Dame just uh, (laughs) in a bit of a state of disarray right now, uh, 0-3 under uh, the hyped up new head coach Marcus Freeman, I think uh, Michigan can start winning head-to-head battles again on the recruiting trail against Notre Dame. Uh, So right now, again, Michigan in a great spot for Brian Robinson. What about Brian Robinson as a player? So I had a chance to see uh, Robinson at the Ray Lewis camp in Ohio earlier this, or I guess back in the off season, I want to say it was in the spring and he had a great uh, camp there. It was more so for linebackers, but uh, at six foot five, two thirty again, looks more like an edge guy kind of uh, filled out a little bit already. Um, I would liken his game a little bit to uh, current Michigan commit Eno Etta and, and Mike Elston really likes kind of those uh, six, five, thickly built edge guys to pair along with more athletic longer types uh so i think every cycle moving forward you're gonna see an athletic longer skinnier longer type and you're gonna see a a thickly built edge as well to so two guys that complement each other well i think that robinson fits kind of that mold of the thicker enoetta type of edge um but he was great at the ray lewis camp showed great length great technique really well coached uh great feet He's a kid that has a really good first step, great get off, um, whether he's playing with his hand in the dirt, whether he's in a stand up position, uh, moved really well in space covering backs, even though he won't really have to do too much of that um, as an edge. I mean, he'll have to do a little bit of it, but look comfortable there. I mean, just a really good, solid athlete with great.
great technique. Um, has really was really impressive on the camp circuit as well uh, as far as school camp. So he went out to Michigan, camped at Michigan um, for one of their on-campus camps and earned defensive line MVP. Really, really impressed Elston there at the Ray Lewis camp that I was at. He uh, earned the leadership award uh, for being a, not only a top performer, uh, but a guy that his peers respected. So again, kind of fits that Michigan man mold. And one thing I didn't mention when talking about his recruitment is Brian Robinson is actually part of the PPI program. If you guys are familiar with PPI, it's actually an international uh, database and recruiting service. It's why Michigan has commitments from guys like Amerik Kumba and Manoa Beagle. And Mike Elson has a great relationship with the founder of that organization, Brandon Collier. Uh, so Robinson is a kid that is really close to Collier, has worked with him a lot despite being uh, an Ohio kid. And I, I think that connection will really help Michigan as well. So overall, Michigan trending in the right direction for Brian Robinson. Uh, close to putting in a pick. It's, it's so early in his recruitment, though, so we'll kind of see how things play out. But right now, uh, I think Michigan is the team to beat. As always, guys, subscribe to the Wolverine. One dollar, one year. Join us for our live show every Wednesday, 7 p.m. Eastern here on our YouTube page. If you're not a subscriber to our YouTube page, go ahead and click the subscribe button completely free. See you guys soon.